Hi, my name is Catherine Patricia Cobbler, and I'm a loop pedal violist, composer, and teaching artist. Welcome to Catalyst. This video series is an introduction to improvisation and discovering our creative voices. Through this video series, we're going to be exploring ways of engaging in improvisation online and off, and going through some kind of rules to live by in engaging in improvisation. Let's get started together. Before we get started, I just wanted to tell you a little bit about myself. So, like I mentioned, my name is Catherine, and I'm a loop pedal violist. What that means is that I'm a solo viola player, like a violin, but a little bit bigger, has a lower sound like the cello, but I also use this device called a loop pedal in performance. What that means is that when I plug into this device, it allows me to make myself sound like a string orchestra. And you're going to hear examples of that as we go on in this video series. Now, together we're going to be exploring improvisation. My experience with improvisation stems from doing live improvisation in concert, but also in my teaching practice as well. One of the methods that I've been trained or have done training in and draw from is the Creative Ability and Development Method by Alice Kanak. There is a set of wonderful methods and books that I would really encourage you to get um, if you're interested in furthering your practice in improvisation. So some of the values and intentions that we're going to be talking about will stem from those practices as well. So let's get started together. So before we start engaging in improvisation, we want to hold a few intentions in mind before diving in to our practice. The first thing is that we need to embrace the truth that in improvisation, there is no such thing as a mistake. Whatever you play or sing and create is right. If you think about it, when we think about the act of composing, composing is just making decision with sound. Now, when we pair that with improvisation, improvisation is just composing live. So whatever you do in the moment, there's no such thing as a mistake. We need to internalize this truth to be able to express and discover our creative voices. 